FBI. Can I sue Boko Haram? No. So, what business do you have saying I'm protected by Boko Haram? And where did you acquire said business? If you can't see reason, what's the difference? May as well just protect me yourself, Boko Haram. I'll show you Haram, you son of a bitch. The entire world is laughing at you. And I've met some of you. And I can't help but presume that most of you, if your ego, if you think there's anything to be saved by pretending that they're laughing at me, qualify your legal immunity. Is it democratic, you think? Smithsonian, if you wouldn't mind, if, if it's not too much trouble, could you please qualify the FBI's legal immunity at this time? Did they suspect somebody doing, were they gonna make an arrest? Do they have a warrant? Is there a, a judge? Treasury, did you, uh, IRS? So, some idiot just gave Afghanistan their own country. Leave Joe Biden, try to pull, him out, pull himself out with scorched tail feathers. This whole thing is so goddamn ridiculous. You're a laughing stock. And now you're claiming Department of Justice? Your honors, when did the Supreme Court commission the Federal Bureau of Investigation? What year was that? These are illegal immigrants. FBI, repeat after me. I, state your name, do solemnly swear. It's not blasphemy, just, just swear to whatever God or higher power you expect to meet if you violate the oath, because we're gonna save them the trip and all the profits the saints and all the angels. Doesn't matter what you think they are, it's what they're called. That I shall first do no harm. I shall guard my charge from injustice. I shall preserve and defend the Constitution of the United States of America against all enemies, foreign and domestic. So help me God. Doesn't matter what you think it is. My name is Noel D. Smith. Dr. Noel D. Smith. Single, straight, no kids, never married. No abortions, no abominations, no divorces, no bankruptcies. Formerly decorated so-and-so with the yada yada. Airframe triage theologies. Uh, no heresies, never sold cocaine, never forged ink on paper. The FBI says the KKK is uh, America's greatest terror threat. What are you, chicken? Ku Klux literally means chicken shit. Ku, to strike. Klux, the sounds made by a chicken. Started after the Civil War by Baptists to hang carpetbaggers. Ended up being taken over by the Protestants. All we had to work with was fatherless know-it-alls. My ancestor died on the opening march. Otherwise, we might have avoided Gettysburg. Regardless, it was at least a decade before the KKK was even founded. Stick me with Boko Haram. Try and try and make it fit for somebody, for some, for some godless heretics campaign fund. Somebody sold Nigeria a lunatic. First, I shall do no harm. And then you ain't never seen crazy. When you call somebody a terrorist, you're, you're calling them crazy. You're calling them a barbarian. Barbarian's a godless, flat earth wizard. A slave raiding cannibal. Some folks like to stay here and act like that. Call it a religion. Well, first, do no harm, or your religion is wrong. Some people wouldn't know religion if it stomped their head into a cactus till they went cross-eyed and shit their pants. Inspire a new space program. 
So I rewrote the rewrote the the IRS charter for charitable non government organizations. If that's allowed, religion is a search for universal and eternal truth. A search. It allows for secularism, sectarianism, cults. Not a whole a lot of uh, we can't reconcile the First Amendment. Or maybe your religion isn't. Maybe you want to roll the dice with the uh, you know eternal caliphate. That's fine. Either way, I rest my case. Religion is a search for universal and eternal truth, unless yours isn't. Now, humanity's greatest enemies can't leverage the First Amendment against our foreign exchange. The FBI can do their job. Try and flat earth me, pipsqueak. All currency is ultimately backed in due process. Doesn't matter how many shekels your camel is worth. If I could just take it. And all war is paid for in religion. Either too much or too little. You can disagree all you want. First, do no harm or you're not even a goddamn doctor. mfrodeo.blogspot.com My first rodeo. I can't wait. Aren't you excited for me? First, do no harm. Or finish what you started.